I'm back, people. Yeah, it's me again. <laughs> oh. Now I gotta run to the doctors and pick up something right quick. This prescription they filled out for me, and they just called me and, and uh, told me that it's ready to be picked up. The doctor signed for it, so I'm on my way to go get that. And that's a little ride, so I was just on here. Get a little time. By me being a new new to this, I gotta find something to uh well while like I'm riding, I can, I can sit my phone up, you know, uh, my recording on. Gotta give me a camera. I've been using my phone. What you been holding up pretty good? They've been recording off of it. So I'm a, uh, but I'm a, keep, I'm a upgrade. <laughs> you know, once I uh, really get all the hang of everything, I upgrade. I'm on the freeway now. Uh, what do y'all call where y'all at? Do y'all call it the freeway or the highway? <laughs> We call it the freeway in California. So, uh, yeah. So I didn't have to get dressed up just to run it. Uh, I just have to run in there and uh, grab the receipt, drop it off. That's all. But like I said, I, I went to go pick up my grandson, so I didn't. And I was laying down when he called me to come pick him up, so I didn't. Uh, I didn't uh, hop on, uh, put on my clothes. Lord, help me, Jesus. The police is riding right next to me. And I'm recording. You know you don't supposed to have no phone in your hand. Recording, doing none of that. As I'm breaking the law, is I? Oh, excuse to me. I guess it's not if I don't get in trouble. <laughs> well, you know how that goes. We all do a little uh, something that we're supposed to be doing, right? If you say no, kick, stop kicking yourself. Because that's what you're doing. Kidding yourself. No, you've done something you're supposed to do. But uh, I don't do it. I don't do it all the time. But uh, yeah. So I'm just making a little, little quick run. And we didn't. Now me and him posted had to run to the store. Now when I got 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 him in the car, he wanted he, he needed to go to the house right quick. So when we get to the to the house, next thing I look around. This boy's gone. He didn't go to the store without me. I'm like, ain't that so? Well, why they do that at? Justin left me. No, he said, Granny, I thought you said you had to be somewhere. <laughs> so I'm just going because I was kind of tired. So I used to figure if he go ahead and walk on up there, um, it'll be, you know, he, he, he won't be so tired. He won't go to sleep. Because he didn't want to go to sleep early. Because if he go to sleep early, then he'll be up during the night. And he got to be up in, oh, for school in the morning. So, I know how that is. And, uh, I don't know why. I can't sleep at night. I be trying. I be trying. I be having so much on my mind. I be like, Lord, come on now. Help me. I need some help with this. This is too much. Thinking about everything and a lot of things. Uh, you just got to give it over to the Lord and relax and rest yourself. Because uh, a lot of things we cannot handle by ourselves. We need Jesus. We need him. And I can't do without him. He walks with me and talks with me and be with me every day. I wouldn't know what to do without that. 
so yeah we need them so that's why I say I give it on over to him and try to relax and not let you know not let nothing get me down like I say my main thing is uh, getting some of this weight off of me because uh, that's what the doctors them telling me that I need some of this weight off of me because I've never been a big person. Never been a big person. Like I said, after I got older, I started gaining a lot of weight. And then I had, and then I, uh, I got the thyroids. I don't know if you ladies know anything about thyroids that grows off of women's. I got them. And so that, they helped me gain weight too. And so now that I got this weight, like I say, when you're older and got this weight on you, it's kind of hard for uh, this weight to get off of you. So now uh, I got to get this weight off of me because it's just, it's, it's, it's not good. The doctor's telling me it's not good. You got to get that weight off. And, uh, and I tell you, the devil have a way. He have a way to try to try to keep you keep you bound. He always try, got a way to try to keep you bound. Cause he know he 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 know <laughs> that I need it all. And that's like I say, how my grandson be cooking and bring me them big plates and and all that stuff. But I got I got to get the power, you know, and just say, uh uh, no, I can't do it. I can't have it. Can't have it. You know. I have, uh, I gotta give me another, I, I'm gonna give me one of them, uh, 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 what you call them, bullets for my smoothies. Because my, uh, my, uh, uh blender, it, it don't blend as good as I like for it to. It don't, it don't, it don't blend as that good. I'm holding this thing in my hand. That's why I say I need something to hold this, hold this with to be talking. Oh, my hand is tired. <laughs> how y'all do it? Tell me something. Tell me something, y'all. Tell me how you go by doing doing this here. Because all this here is new to me. So, uh, you just got to bear with me. Bear with me. I'll get it together. That's for sure. I'll get it together. Okay, look like I can go. I'll definitely get it together. But uh, if you can tell me, you know, what do I need to hold it up in the car, I'd like for you to, you know, put it down below so I, you know, know what to do. Uh, every little bit helps. You can help me, I can help you, we can help each other. So okay people, so I done made it here. So I'm gonna run off in here and get this here uh, from the uh, nurse. And uh, drop it off at the pharmacy. And I might be back on later. I don't know. Like I say, I gotta run to the store and figure out what I'm I wanna eat. I might get me a salad. I'm doing. I really don't want no salad, so I I I really don't know what I'm gonna get, cause I really don't want no salad. I like salads, but I, that ain't really what I got no taste for. So I can find find me. I'll find me something that ain't you know ain't fattening. You know, I know I gotta go get me some fruits, cause I I done ran out of them. And my problem is eating at night too. Eating at night, laying down, that's not good. That's not good. I got to stop that. And even though it don't be much that I'm eating. Just just knowing I'm just putting putting uh, something in my mouth to, at night time, knowing I'm laying down. It's not good. And then I got that acid reflex. And, you don't, and the doctor told me don't eat like three hours before you lay down. Because that would, uh, that would help mess with your acid reflex too. And I have a problem with doing that. And that acid reflex is not no joke. I wouldn't wish that on nobody to have no acid reflex. 
It is, oh, you know, it is bad. But, uh, for God help, I've been trying to deal with it. But I got to do something, you know, myself. But I'm, I'm getting it together. Once, once you know what you got to do, you got to do, you got you to put your foot down and say, I got to do this. I got to do this to survive. I got to do, you know, I got to do this, you know. And I know I can do all things through, through Christ that strengthen me. And, and you can too. You can do it too. He is strengthening you too. The only thing you got to do is ask and pray. And put it, put it, put it, give it to the Lord. He'll help you and see you through it. But okay, y'all, I'm going to uh, talk with y'all later. Uh, I hope y'all have a nice day. And again, God bless y'all. All right, sugars.